Okay, Ryan Stanelson here with another update. This is the February update for the partner newsletter for local service ads. And let me just share my screen here. So here's the uh, partner updates for February 2021. Uh, a couple things that not a, not a lot really in this in this update, but some really um, you know some some things that are definitely important to stay aware of. One that'll allow you to allow more people. Uh, uh, featured professionals to your uh, roster on your LSA page, which is kind of nice. By the way, if you have any questions about local service ads, you can definitely ask us. We've been uh, running local service ads since they started three years ago. And uh, we've been uh, an agency for almost 12 years now, over a decade, and have been helping businesses uh, to get more leads through Google My Business, local service ads, and uh, getting great reviews. So I'm going to start at the top. Pinkerton and Everton background checks uh, process restart. This we use a lot. If you're not getting anywhere with the uh, with the background check process, we typically will restart the process um, after 30 days. My goodness, if it's been 90 days, then there's a problem. I mean, that's that's a little, that's a little bit long to wait, in my opinion. The other thing is, is there's an address change. Uh, if there's error message uh, preventing you from starting or completing your background check, you can see you know some of the other reasons here. So this is this is what you want to pay attention to is. Um, you know, if you have that uh, background check going very long, you definitely want to restart it. Now, we do have ways to avoid having to restart. Um, you can get a hold of people at Pinkerton. We definitely can. So if you're not able to get a hold of people at Pinkerton, we can because we have access to people at Evident and Pinkerton. Because we've actually just found recently we were we submitted a background check and weren't getting any feedback from um, evident at all. And there's a process, there's a specific process you have to follow if you want your agency to represent you. And we know what that process is. So if you want us to, we can, um, we can represent you and we can get, we can find out what's going on and why you're not getting approved. Okay. So please let us know if you're having problems getting approved. Um, sometimes it's very important to, to have access, um, like we do, um, we have partner level access, like I've said before, and that makes all the difference in the world a lot of times. So license extensions due to COVID. So basically Michigan and California have extended the license requirements and, and dates uh, for pest control and lawn care in Michigan and then real estate in California. Uh, providers can remove field workers from evident roster at any point before adjudication. So basically before evident goes through and looks at your background check, you can remove people through in the process from your submission. Uh, reminder that business owners cannot ever be removed, and then additional field work, field workers cannot currently be added. You know, uh, during the process, you, you've got to stick with what you've submitted in the beginning. Um, this is interesting. So there's a max of ten featured professionals allowed. So this is what we're talking about here. So you, you can see here, here's the uh, their uh, local service ad page here. Uh, for one of our clients and you can see down here this is where the featured professionals are okay and there's 10 of them as you can see and that's the maximum amount that um, <clears throat> that Google is allowing before there was only one featured professional now there's 10 which is really good there is no cap on listed professionals only featured okay so this just applies to, to the featured on the LSA page which is these guys right here and you definitely want to submit those. If you don't know how to do that, let us know. And there is a finessing of the photo sometimes that needs to be done in order to get those approved. The number of professionals listed is attached to the uh, account along with applicable requirements, uh, licensee. So you need to submit the, uh, the account details as well and the license in order to get them <clears throat> to show up there. So that's the update for February. If you need any help in any part of the process, we can help. We, this is what we do all day, every day is local service ads <clears throat> and we also um, have been um, getting our clients and uh, new clients approved on google my business and optimized on google my business uh, along with doing reputation management for like i said over a decade now and we can help you we'd love to help you we've been doing this for a long time and <clears throat> definitely know the ins and the outs and can and it can make a big difference in your business um, if you get on you know, background checked, you know, a month early, earlier than you would of yourself. It can make a big difference in terms of the number of leads you get 
And we can also significantly help you increase your lead volume by implementing some of the strategies that we've learned in the past three years. If you get one or two new clients, I mean, per month, and, and we see that kind of increase all the time. Um, we just took on a client recently and they were getting one or two leads a week. And uh, we flipped a few switches in their account. And now they're getting, you know, multiple cases in the uh, personal injury attorney vertical. So anyway, thanks. Let me know if you have any questions. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.